siren here. This is what brings out the sound whenever the power is being restored. So over here we have the timer, the only timer, and we have the relay. So let's go into connections. First thing is these are um, live cable, the red cable. This is our neutral cable. Now, this is the main relay. As you can see, we have pin 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, and 8. So, the first connection you're going to do, your live cable. This is the live cable. The live cable is going to be connected to pin 7. Pin 7. To pin 7. So your live cable will be connected to pin 7. As you can see pin 7 over here. Then from pin 7, you loop pin 7 and pin 8. This, this is my cable that I'll be using for the looping. I'll be connecting my live cable here. Then I'll be looping pin 7 and pin 8. So you should know there's a, that means two cables will be connected to pin 7, then a cable will be connected to pin 8. The live cable going to pin 7, then you loop from pin 7 to pin 8. So let's see how it goes. So as you can see, uh, pin 7, let me use pin 7, then I have the life cable into pin 7, As you can see, I've connected the live cable to the pin 7, then I will loop from pin 7 to pin 8. From pin 7 to pin 8. As you can see, this is pin 8. I'm losing the screw already. Then let me connect pin 8. As you can see, I've connected the life to pin 7, then I've looped from pin 7 to pin 8. Now let's go to the neutral cable. As you can see, this is my neutral cable, the black cable. The neutral cable will be going to pin 2. The neutral cable will be going to pin 2. Mind you, this siren has a particular neutral cable as well. You know. This siren from the middle here we have alternate current to 20 volts. So the alternate current is signifying that and is also indicating that anyone can be neutral, anyone can be branch. So it's not like specific that this is a particular one. So let me just take one as my neutral. Let me take one from the left. So you'll be connecting the neutral one cable from the siren. You'll be connecting one cable from the siren. To the neutral cable to so supply neutral to the siren so i'm connecting one cable from the siren to the neutral cable as you can see Now I'll be connecting the both of them into pin 2.
Now I need to tighten it very well. I need to ensure tight connection. Ensure you tighten it very well. In order for the alarm to function. So it has been tightened. Now the next thing you do, the second cable from the siren, as you can see, this is the second cable from the siren, it will be connected to pin 5. The second cable will be connected to pin 5. As you can see over here, we have pin 3, we have pin 4, and we have pin 5. So it will be connected to pin 5. Let me lose in pin 5. I have pin 5 here, then the second cable to pin 5. Ensure tight connection as well. Ensure tight connection. Yeah, so it's connected now. Now, I want to connect the only timer. Not something. Can you see the label here? You ensure the label is connected in the same angle with this red fin over here. You ensure the label, can you see this label here? You ensure it is connected parallelly with the same this, this yellow indicator here, this yellow thing. Can you see that? Now, let me set my timer. Actually, now let me set my timer. You can set it to 10. You can set it to 5 seconds, to 10 seconds, to 15, to 20, to 25. So, wherever you set it to, that means it will sound for 5 seconds, if you, sound, if you set it to 5 seconds, it will sound to 5 seconds, then it will stop. If you set it to 10 seconds, it will sound for 10 seconds and it will stop. If you set it to 15 seconds, it will sound for 15 seconds and it will stop. Okay, let me just set it to 5 seconds, then as we go power it now. So as you can see, this is what will be serving as, as our source of power so the alarm is set to five seconds to five seconds so just watch now as we power it can you see that it is set to five seconds so now let me set our alarm to 10 seconds to 10 seconds to 10 seconds then watch as I power it. Can you see? Yeah, viewers. So that is just exactly how to connect a power alarm. If you like to watch more of our videos, kindly subscribe to our YouTube channel. And don't forget to like the video and share. Thank you very much. I love you all. I remain my humble self, Mrs. Okocha.